so many people ask me, Neil, what is drifting? If I could break drifting down to just one little thing, I would say drifting is time. It's the time spent in the garage, it's the time spent working on the car, it's the time spent traveling to and fro the track. But more specifically, we could talk about timing. So it's the timing of that throttle input. It's the timing of that clutch kick. It's the timing of the handbrake pull, of that initiation, of that transition. Everything has to be done at a specific time. And if you don't do that, at worst, well, you're off the judge's line. At best, <laughs> you're in the wall. And with seven clipping points on a wall here in Dunleary, that's a massive risk. And it's a risk that we all take. Every driver on here is willing to risk their car against these walls to make sure that they do exactly what the judges say. So really, as I say, drifting is timing. If you get it right, well, it makes all that time worthwhile. The trill on track, when everything is going right, it just washes away all those breakages, all that time spent practicing, making sure everything is right, all that money, it's just worth it. So, drifting, drifting is time. Track walk time here at Drift of the Docks, round two of the Drift Games Extreme Championship. Unfortunately, I just got knocked out in top 32. I went against Mac Mark McBurney. Uh, didn't do a great job in the chase position, but absolutely delighted with my lead run. Look, at, it is what it is. We uh, come back to fight another day. We're going to go back out for DGX in uh, Mondello, round three. And uh, just can't wait for that. Car's going to get a brand new look for round three, and uh, it's going to look pretty amazing. So working with Megaspec, 
getting that all done. Can't wait to show you all at Roundtree. We'll see you then.